Hi guys, welcome to my channel Electronic Secret. Today I am showing you how to make a LED tester using multimeter. I have made this with the help of a LED bulb and you can see that it is working fine. It is used for checking LED backlight strips, LED bulb strips and you can also check zener diode from it. I will show you all the method of making it and the parts required for this. You can use your own do it your daily life parts like LED bulb and a resistor. You can easily make it. Watch the video till end. Subscribe my channel if you have not. Hit the bell notification. These are Zener viewers. You can also check it. You can also check these from backlight tester. Viewer, this is the original backlight tester. Technicians are well known of this, but it is very costly. I will made using a multimeter in almost zero cost you will need a empty casing of charging adapter a wire mark r and b on the red and black on the on the legs so so the polarity cannot be changed you will need a 5 watt 33 kilo ohms resistor a led bulb we will open this and remove its backlight driver and remove its backlight driver. This is the backlight driver. If you have not LED bulb, you can purchase it from electronic shops. It is easily available. The two white wires are input and the red and white wire is output. You will connect the red wire to the red marking and yellow wire and white to the black marking black wire first of all i will connect the input that is 220 volt wire now it is connected now i will check the output voltage how much voltage is coming you can see that it is showing 33 volt dc Take two probes and cut them. Solder here. After this 5 watt 33 kilo ohms resistor, you will solder the red wire here, weavers. Red probe. Because it is a positive side. Now take this yellow wire and red probe and the resistor and solder them. Make a hole into the casing and pass the red probe wire from there. So it will not mess up in future. Now yellow and red wires are connected. Connect the resistor and solder these. Now one part is solder, it's turned from the other. Take the black probe, insert it from the hole that I have made earlier in the casing. Now take the second output wire that is ground, joint them. Take the black wire off the casing and solder them. Weavers, if you have any question regarding this and parts used, you can ask in comment section. I will reply them. Now the all the connections are made and I have insulated it to avoid shock. Now put all the things in the casing and pack them like this. I have packed them. Now it's time for testing. Insert correct polarity mentioned on the casing first of all i will check the led bulb strips then backlight strips then zener diode put the meter on 200 volt dc insert the ac card into the socket Voltage will be shown here. 
now you can see that it have 33.3 volts now take the black and red probe and place it on the minus and plus signs on the bulb strip you can see that the all the bulb strip is glowing and 100 volt is showing on the meter so our tester is working fine you can also check led bulb one by one like this now i am checking the backlight strip of a tv you can see that two lights are not glowing and all others are glowing and it is also showing the voltage on the meter so this backlight is faulty viewers because its two lights are not glowing this is the good one viewers and okay backlight strips its all lights are glowing you can see that the voltage is showing 30 volts on the meter you can check the bad ones and the good ones with this so no matter no problem all the lights are glowing viewers now i will check again a faulty backlight five bulbs are glowing viewers and four are not and the voltage showing is 13 volt as the bulbs are in series and each bulb contains 3 volt now i will check the zener voltage this is very good viewers because they have very small value written on them and we cannot read it so this is a 15 volt zener it is 18 volt zener and this is 12 volt zener so I have explained all the methods of checking backlight strip, bulb strips and you can easily made it instead of buying the original backlight tester. This is a diagram of the backlight tester. Hope you have enjoyed it kindly. Share it with your friends and subscribe my channel. Thank you friends.